Yo, what's going on guys? It's actually coming at you today with another YouTube video. Final edition, Devin McCourty. 98 overall free safety. That makes, what is that, two final edition free safeties we have. Now, one card that I looked at earlier that is really kind of strange, good, but also bad at the same time. William Gay, 90 overall cornerback. Compared to Charles Woodson, 91 speed, 94 excel. 87 agility. 81 man. That's what's so weird about this card. How do you have 81 man coverage? 91 zone, 86 press, 95 play rec, 70 catching. But this guy is a really good run stuffer. He has 70 catching, 84 tackle, and he also has 81 block shots. That's really good. But his block shedding is the same as his man. Like, that's just terrible. We have. Chandrick West, I think that's how you name it, or Charcandic Rest. He has 95 speed, 90 excel, 90 elusiveness, 80 trucking, 98 elusiveness, elusiveness, 97 juke move. So we did sell Adrian Peterson. There is a set that is on Madden Mobile. Three captains and three or three heroes get you a positional hero player. So I did sell AP and invest some coins into that. I have about 36, 37 captains right now, so I'm really hoping that it does come out. I'll give it about a week. If it does not come out, then I'm going to just hold the L and sell the captain players back. But, looks like a really good card. Really elusive, not too good at juking, or not too good at trucking. Very good juke move. Decent catching, 79. Uh, good juke move, good spin move. Well, 92 is decent. 93 stamina, 93 injury. Decent looking card there. I'm sure a lot of Chiefs fans are happy about that. We have a 93 Zach Ertz. Tight end for the Eagles. Compared to Delaney Walker, this guy looks like a really good receiver. And also a run blocker. This guy's kind of like a budget Delaney Walker. 87 speed, 79 strength, 81 run block, 94 catch, 93 release, 90 right running, 90 catch in traffic, and a 94 spec catch. That release is really good. Can you hold his block? What's his impact? 80 impact block, and that's really good for a tight end. So if you guys want a budget tight end, I'm sure his price will fall in a little bit. Be sure to pick up that guy. We have a 94 overall Carlos Dunlap. I was waiting for this guy to get a new card ever since he got that team of the week. 85 speed, 90 strength, 93 excel, 91 tackle. They run block shed, 74 power move, 96 finesse move, 88 play recognition. Good block shed for a 4-3 defensive end. Good strength. Decently fast, good finesse move. Once again, a good budget for 3 defensive end. I have Jason Taylor there. Or I have Jason Taylor there. Even though I'm a 3-4, Jason Taylor does really well in my scheme. Gets a lot of sacks. We have Austin Howard, another key piece to that Raiders offensive lineman. That seems to get better and better. I'll actually have another Raiders alignment right here. 98 strength, 90 awareness, 66 agility, 63 speed, 79 acceleration, 91 run block, 95 pass block, 91 impact block. So I've heard that the Raiders O-line is supposedly supposed to be one of the best in the NFL. Yeah, I disagree and I'm going to have to go with the Cowboys have the best O-line. Let me know who you guys think have the best O-line in the NFL. I don't think I'm just saying it because, you know, the Cowboys. But I'm pretty sure the left tackle position is probably going to be uh, Tyron Smith. Because Tyron Smith is definitely one of the best left tackles in the NFL. And unless it's Joe Thomas, of course. But then he just get a new card. I'm not sure if Joe Thomas actually got a new card or not. But we'll figure that out. So uh, why am I looking at position heroes? I don't know. Let's take a look at final edition. Where is it at? Final edition. Find out price. Free safety. And we have Harrison Smith. Devin McCourty for 380k. 98 overall free safety. I'm sure he's very good coverage. 96 speed, 96 excel. 92 player X, 78 tackle. 93 man, 98 zone. 93 pursuit, 69 hit power. What's his catching of an 83? 70 tackle. What's his block shot? Block shot of 77. Wow, 99 stamina 2. This card is amazing. So if you want a straight coverage, 
safety. If you even have some butchers that put your safety in man coverage, I guess this is your guy. I mean, he was a cornerback. Man, 98 zone coverage and 93 man coverage. That is an extremely good card. If you guys want to take a risk, I would say go buy some captain cards right now because you never know if that's just going to come out. But if it does, these captain cards are definitely going to rise to a 40, 50k each. Because if it is just three of these, which it also may be, uh, maybe you need some position hero collectibles. Maybe like five, ten of them or something. But 13k, 14k, these could possibly go up to 35, 40. 50k each and I have a lot of these so if you guys feel like making an investment go for that and also if you guys like the Jason McCordy let me know and I'll see you guys in the next video